Well, people in Japan are having fewer babies than ever before. The number of newborns hit a record low last year and the government says time is running out to prevent a population collapse. Our Asia correspondent Stash Butler has this report. Every year, Tokyo's playgrounds become quieter as Japanese have fewer kids. And new figures suggest an even faster population drop. Fewer than 800,000 babies were born here last year, a record low in a country of 125 million. The decline of births is in a state of crisis. The next six years up until the 2030s, when the population of young generations is expected to decline rapidly, are the last chance to see if the declining birth rate trend can be reversed. And I believe we are at a time when we have to take urgent measures. But years of government action have failed to help, and many are resigned to a future with fewer kids. I think Japan is already well past the time limit for solving its declining population. My feeling is that if we don't change direction and put in place systems that welcome workers from overseas, it won't be enough to solve the problem. It's becoming harder and harder for grandparents to help. So I think from the very beginning, the social environment makes it hard for women to have a lot of children and continue to work. It's not just Japan. Neighbouring South Korea could see its population halve by the end of the century if things don't change. But barriers to having kids in East Asia remain high and governments are reluctant to embrace immigration instead leaving some of the world's biggest economies in a slow-motion demographic decline. Stash Butler, Sky News, Taipei.